Hi friends, welcome to Testing Tutorials Point. This is Lokesh Gorantra and today we are going to discussing about mobile automation testing by using Python. Hi friends, welcome back. And last video session we can able to see accessing the context, right? In the context what we done, like how we can able to read that particular context, how many like uh, how many apps are we opened in a runtime and also we validated for a newly uh, open app some value right that we printed now we are going to do for some more some more operation we'll do for what we first we will open for first app and we'll navigate to second app and then the second app will do some performances then we'll come back into the first app without making a switch cases okay without doing any additional thing we can directly accessing that particular apps okay direct actions we are not using for any indirect actions for this we used up to here we done right in this particular symbol we can able to click and uh, we'll do for uh, we'll click for about and all we will see okay for this what i can do right i'll copy this entire thing Fine. and uh, there is a view one okay we need to cancel that particular one and i'm copying this particular symbol okay pasting the symbol then i'm going to use for el5 dot click action okay once i click the action then uh, we need to do some more additional operations <laughs> I click this one and then I need to click for about okay then uh, I'll connect for that particular app one more time oh uh, that is a view in about one then again I'll uh, copy this X path one more time okay then the text is about and clicking for that particular app location then you can see this a color note is simple and get smart note this is the app one and i'll use for bio text one okay and sixth one is a seven and i'm going to print for this particular one print is l7 dot text okay now after completion of the actions just i will use to back this particular one if i click this particular symbol sorry if i click this one i'll navigate it back to my original app my original app I'm, I'm able to navigate right this i want to go back for this i can use for call level driver dot back okay by using this back keyword and we can able to going to back uh, like this one we used in the python selenium automation time like uh, uh, driver dot forward and driver dot backward direction the like in the browser history we are going forward and backward direction right the similar format here it is the similar format okay now i'm going to run one more time whether we can able to do after all the actions whether we navigated back to the original app or not okay by seeing we can able to do it but in the assertion and all we can able to see in the later video sessions okay how we can able to do some assertions and all Now it is cancelled and it clicked for about and it reads the value okay 
okay backward it is not happen one more time i'll copy three backwards i'm using the backward direction is basically it will give you to go back to the same original app but now it is not loading we'll see now it is cancelled and clicked about now back see completely it is closed and we used uh, three times right one time it is not working and uh, minimum two times you have to use for driver dot back then only it will go back and the third also if you use completely it will close okay there is a way we can able to go for original and even we can able to do some assertions and all also here because we need to use here normal way i'm explaining okay assertions and all when i'm explaining about that frameworks and all that moment i can able to show you how we can able to do for some assertion and all okay and next video session we can able to use the contacts how we can able to implement and all i will see when the contacts okay thank you for watching subscribe and share to your friends and colleagues and don't forget to comment on this video thank you